Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave, and I am back with more reactions with an X One Piece, and we are super happy to get into what I believe is episode 993. Yep, and it's gonna be a great one, guys. Like, uh, I think this is a part of the story that really flows well, and as long as they do the anime correctly, I think they should have no trouble making some great episodes with the next set of story, right? So, if you, you know, enjoy watching, let me know, because we, uh, we're definitely moving towards doing more series, and I'm looking for suggestions for new stuff, because there are going to be weeks where One Piece isn't releasing, or something else happens, right? And we would just want to keep giving you guys great content. Uh, I also want to, as always, give a big shout out to the patrons who get this early video and audio fully uncut on Patreon for as low as a dollar a month, and I really appreciate you guys, you make the whole world spin for me, so thank you. Uh, secondly, check out the original content, you know, Achira Oda and the great people at, I think, what is it, Funimation that makes One Piece, whatever, uh, they work pretty hard, and I, I think that shows in the difference between when One Piece started and now, how they've changed with the times, improved quality, and while there are sometimes issues with pacing, as there tend to be with weekly shows like this, I do think that it is a pretty good anime and worth the watch, and obviously you probably do too if you're watching this. With that said, uh, I do want to get right into this. I, it, it's going to be a great episode. As we saw, you know, we have this whole Yamato thing, and I don't want to spoil things for you, but Yamato is a f great character, right? The, the interactions between Yamato and other characters are fun and hilarious, and just her whole, you know, preface of being this char character who's totally inspired by Odin and changes to basically be Odin, right? Like, that's the whole goal, is to be Odin, at least for Yamato. So, with that said, we're gonna go ahead and get into the episode, and I hope you guys enjoy watching. Ah, yes, the party. Which is still going, despite the fact they know they have invaders. No, these guys aren't all rushing over to go fight. In attic. <laughs> Just in attic. That definitely needed. Definitely needed that. They're there. Oh man, this fight's hilarious. Kinda like it's. Like a lot of people were talking so much shit when this fight went down. I remember. It, we're still a couple episodes away, minimum, but I know it's coming, man. <laughs> I, I didn't remember that. God, they haven't seen each other in 20 years? Almost? Jesus, or more? More than 20 years. I love that they're both kind of like feminine in appearance, but Izo's voice is just straight man tone no no one not at all womanly i don't remember this at all who are they fighting headless horsemen i i don't remember this at all at all I was wondering when they would go over this. I think they originally covered it in the uh, when he shows up and gives him to Orochi. Blam! 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 Man, he's laying into his ass. Oof. Child abuse. I just wonder, does he really think he can take all of them? 
Man, I was excited for this episode, and they still turned it into a fucking kind of filler fest. He does have an interesting sword. I'll give him that at least. I was going to say, they're definitely cutting this till another episode for the fight, but yeah, that was a hell of a... Maybe just for the commercial, I don't know, but that was a hell of a fucking piece of filler. <laughs> this is one of those fights that I guess it's cool to have in, but it's not... Like, one of those fights every like everybody wanted to see. Like, the fight with Ulti and Luffy had, like, a lot of expansion to it. But everybody loved that fight and wanted to see more. Oh, my God. No fucking way. No fucking way. Wait up, wait up, wait up, wait up. They showed headshots in One Piece. Like, that, Blades. She just headshot. She shot that dude in the, in the head. And then he just guns that guy down. <laughs> They're so fucking funny. They're such like brothers, you know what I mean? I mean, yes. If you're. F I'm gonna tell you this straight up, and this is basically can apply 100% of the time. If your friendship, relationship, etc., was based on a lie, it's not real. <laughs> The Power Ranger animation was so funny there, honestly. I mean, it was. It wasn't that you were that sneaky. It's just like... Yeah, this is so pulled and extended out. I know it's just to make you hate him for when he gets fucked up later, but... Inevitably fucked up later. Or maybe right now. Cut his ass down! That's a pretty cool line. I forgot they all technically have titles like that, like of the evening mist, of the falling snow. I think all of them have titles like that. I just don't remember them at all. Or if we've even heard all of them. Oh god, and then we're back here again. At least this is probably not gonna... Ah oh, no, it's probably gonna be fillered in. And, and hit that should have hit her too, but whatever. Uh oh, boy, big boy's in trouble. That's a long ass time, boys. And not just Wano, that island in specific. Shut up. Up, you gotta That's so stupid. <laughs> Just bend wall out of the way. Out of the way, scrubs. She really does look like the witch from a mm, fairy tale. Four goddamn billion berries for her. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That episode was full of fucking filler. Like, I guess maybe probably half the episode was just that filler piece with, like, uh, Conjuro. And while some of it was really cool, like the Kiku and Conjuro talk was pretty emotional, I think it was a little overdone. 
and it just uh, i was hoping for a little more i do think thankfully that the parts with uh yamato were really well done and weren't extended too far kind of like they had been in previous episodes so at least they're picking different pieces of the story but i feel like if you're going to do this kind of episode where it's really more filler stuff like this is an episode to cut a bunch back and forth to give the episode a feel of real movement and story progress because when it's like just and obviously i'm sure like not you're not a manga reader and aren't comparing it at all to that that it's just fine right because it's just another piece of the story it's it does add in that momo explanation why it was all beat up etc which i do like but other than that i do think this episode was like a bunch of filler still not necessarily a super bad episode i think there were some really funny and good parts in it and uh it was definitely a good watch just could maybe use a little bit of cutting down on the, the editing room floor Having said that, I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I would love to hear your thoughts. If you want to comment below, check out the Discord. Big shout out again to the patrons. As always, this will be available to like a week early or something. Just under a week early on the Patreon. You'll see the password. And for people on YouTube, if you enjoyed watching, you know, thank you so much for watching. Maybe give it a like. Maybe comment. Tell me what you liked or that I'm an idiot. Either way, both are valid opinions. And one of those two things are true. <laughs> Uh, but uh, yeah I really appreciate you guys and if you want to watch more as always hit the subscribe button click the bell for notifications and as a you know just come chat with us we love talking about this stuff uh, we love reading manga watching anime watching movies and just enjoying them take maybe criticizing them a little bit but just trying to enjoy them the best we can so thanks as always guys and I'll catch you next time on reactions with the next one